Boom, we're back. Easy. I'm gonna do one hour intervals this time. Bloody crimson caravans scooping up all the blessings. Hurry, man. I must leave for the Dominion post haste. I must I'm leave for the Dominion post haste. I dare say I might get there before sundown. Yeah, I don't want any smiles. I don't want any Pepe laughs. I don't want any, oh, this next part's going to be crazy. I don't want to be any of that. Why I don't care. Water, Nothing. Come one, come all. Feast your eyes. I'm about to, like, not vent a little bit, but, like, people people do that. Like, oh, man, I'm not going to say much, but, like, this part, like, is going to blow your mind away. Like, stuff like that. Like, I don't want to know. Stuff like, dude, 14 community has made the smile freaking emoji basically a spoiler. I'm so over it. How much for a measly crust of bread? You won't find any cheaper. Not nowadays. I am more than welcome to look. Measly crust of bread. That looks good, though. Uh. The Empire's unlawful and illegitimate occupation of the Crystalline Dominion is still in effect. Only those whose business in Twinside has been officially approved by the Republican Army will be permitted to cross the border. Uh -oh. All who seek entry at a former line and ready their documents for inspection. It looks like we aren't the only ones who are eager to leave. And they're checking everyone. Can't you make an Not for the likes of you. We won't get through without that pass. Let's go and find good, shall we? He must be around here somewhere. No, I don't think it'll be that hard to find him. Rose like the Hulk. Me to the Dominion. Life will be different there. Mm. You won't find anything of this quality in Twinside. I'm not buying. I'm not here to buy. There you are. Oh, good. There you are. Clive, I'm so sorry. Don't tell Nan, will you? What do you mean about what? Slow down, good. Just tell us what happened. It's betrayed us, pass. It's gone. Oh, my. We cannot ride the caravan without it. We won't even be able to get through the flipping checkpoint. Bro, oh, you had one job. Do you remember when you last saw it? It was in my pocket a minute ago. Then a burn bumped into me and... Yeah. You don't think that they might have nicked it, it do you? It probably did. It wouldn't surprise me. A busy market like this is prime territory for pickpockets. So, to get the pass back, we need to find this child. Where would we even start? <gasps> I, I know where. I, I've got a pal in Bocklad who might be able to help us. No one knows more about what goes on round here than she does. Where do we find her? She's the owner of the Crimson Caravans up that way. Sounds the Crimson Caravan. No Wait a minute. Present. You two go on ahead. I'm gonna check the rest of my stuff, make sure no one else is missing. All right. We'll meet you there. Let's keep an eye out for this red chocobo then. And the other one, our purses. Still a checkpoint. Wait. Red. 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 my sight, wretch. Chocobo. Oh no. Looking to hire a coach? It's ten million for a two-birder to the Crystalline Dominion. Take it or leave it. Oh, we're not here for that. Then I bid you good day. Wait, no, come back, please. Wait, just don't go, El. He's been made. As I live and breathe. Goots, what are you doing back in Bocklad? <laughs> I 
I gather Lady Karen didn't send you. Don't say it, 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 don't say it. So what trouble have you got yourself into this time? Uh, it's me trader's pass. It, it got stolen. By little Ben. Of all the... You're the size of a marble. <laughs> See, that's Honestly. what I'm saying. Ugh. Goots told us that you know the markets well. Might you have an idea which little ban could have done this? We don't intend to punish them. We just need our pass back. Then we can be on our way. I see. I need so more than just a pass now. Who has a trader's pass either? <laughs> Not that anyone would take you for traders, but I suppose that's why you came to me, correct? Now, I can't say for sure who took your pass, but I suspect I know why they did it. Let me explain. Ever since the Fist marched on the Dominion, the Republic has been clamping down on any commerce that might aid the Empire more than it does us. Which means traders' passes have gone from being merely a way of easing one's progress to being essential if one wishes to cross the border at all. And with demand outstripping supply, they've become a precious commodity, leading some to seek to acquire them by less than legitimate means. So the children are stealing passes to sell on the black market? Yes, and no. Passes are inscribed with the names of their owners, and yet none of the victims' names have appeared on the register of those passing through the checkpoint. Which means? That someone is doctoring the stolen passes. The same someone who is encouraging the children to steal them. And the same someone who has Goots's pass, no doubt. Whoever they are, they're ruining the livelihoods of honest merchants, which is why we've decided to take a stand. Will you stand with us? You want to get your pass back, and we want to ensure that no more are stolen. Catch whoever's behind it all, and two birds shall be slain with a single stone. Is there any other way of getting to the Crystalline Dominion goods? They won't let you in if you're not with the caravan. It's that, uh, I don't know, try swimming across the strait. But, but the guards will definitely spot you if you try and do that. Like, uh, we don't want to get spotted, right? So either we find the people who took the pass, or give up all hope of entering the Dominion. All right. We'll help. Thank you kindly. Um... Yeah, but I don't know your name. Eloise at your service. Clive. A pleasure doing business with you, Clive. The proprietor of the furniture makers by the coach stop is spearheading the search. Wear that, and he will know you for a friend. Gotcha. I suggest that you speak with Another him Boy Scout first. badge. The furniture makers. Understood. Got one more question before we go. Wait, no. Can you marry me? I mean, oh, sorry. Sorry, that was my goldfish talking. My bad. Out of my sight. Jug of snake spit for the road? Jug of snake spit? No! And in some circumstances, isn't that literally just kind of like poison? I mean, obviously not, because there's no reason they'd be selling for people to drink, but still, it sounds, sounds contradictive. Are you the furniture maker? 
Looking for something in particular? Ah, and are we collared you too, eh? Then I expect you want to know more. She told me you were leading the hunt for the pickpockets. What have we learned? For one, that they're targeting the traders carrying the biggest packs. Harder to watch your back, see? And less chance of the mark giving chase if they're spotted. Not that they'd be likely to catch them. Those imps know every inch of this warren like the backs of their hands. Their eyes must have lit up when they saw Goots. The fishmonger, round by the gate, has been trying to track down the children involved. You should go and have a word with her. Thank you. We will. Find anything of this quality in Twinside? The snake oil? No, I don't want to buy the snake oil. To the Dominion. Life. Fish for sale, fresh sorted and smoked. Can I interest you? Ah, sorry. Message from Eloise, is it? She's asked me to help her. To help you find the pickpockets. Is that so? I suppose I better tell you what I know then. For one, this isn't a family operation. All the traders say the children who stole their passes were dirty, dressed in rags. Street urchins, by the sound of it. We get a lot around here. Orphans from the wars. A few, perhaps. You saw the refugees gathered by the entranceway? They're all looking for a new start in the Dominion and beyond. Some of them take it as an opportunity to rid themselves of unwanted baggage. The shame of it. Yeah, Whoever's that's... behind this would have to have made themselves known to the children at some point. And so should we. Fucked. You should start with the children around here, then. I doubt they're the ones involved, but they might have heard something. It's worth a try. Oh, yeah. It is right indeed then. worth a try. Questioning children. How hard can that be? Get it, boy! Good boy. Oh, let's go. Come taste my peaches. They're sweet as nectar. Excuse me. Do you mind if I ask you something? Can't stop me. I was just wondering if anyone has asked you to do anything. Out of the ordinary recently. <sighs> Only thing you grown ups ever ask us to do is shut up and go away. This is my first time to be here. About to tell you to do. Sorry. I'll leave you alone. Hey yo, this is my for this is our first time being here, little kid. Oh, you don't know, you don't oh, you're so lucky. This is a social hub, bro. Oh man. <laughs> oh dude. Okay. Come taste my peaches. They're sweet as nectar. I can't even talk to you. Little kids, bro. I'll oh my god. Oh, you look suspicious. Do you have a moment? What do you want? What I want is to know who's asking children like you to pick pockets. I don't know. Nobody's asked me. What's picking pockets? Do you get paid for it? No, uh, you get in trouble for it. So if they come calling, you know what to tell them. Jeez. Caravan stops next to the checkpoint. Uh, excuse me. What do you want? I don't have any money. It's all right. We're not going to hurt you. We just want to talk. W what about? We've heard that some very bad people are making children like you steal from travelers. We need to know who's behind it so we can stop them. I don't know much about it, really. But my friend, Honza, he, he said he got a job doing something dangerous. Sounds promising. 
We need to find him and ask. Do you know where your friend might be? He's usually by the tent outside town. Thank you. You've been very helpful. What if we're being baited? Come on, come on. Peters and pears. Peters and pears. Let me carry your goods. I'm cheap. Hop and a skip away. Hop, skip, hop, skip, hop, skip, hop. She must have been the refugee hop, camp. Skip. Let's hope he's still nearby. Daddy, I'm hungry. Yeah, enough of your whining. What the? Bro, at least comfort your kid. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that big fat donkey was easy picking. Hey! He wouldn't have noticed if we robbed his boots off him. <laughs> yeah, wish we hadn't handed over the pass, though. Could use one of those things to get out of this dump. Chance would be a fine thing. The moment they found out, they'd string us up by our guts. Would they now? Perhaps you'd like to introduce us to these charming characters. Shit, we're in trouble now. Don't try to run. What do we do? You two get caught if you want. I'm off. Hunter, where are you going? So that was Hunter, eh? Jill, you watch these two. I'm going after him. Oh my god. Bro, right. really think he'd outrun me, dude. Okay. He can't have gone far. I need to find him before his employers do. Do it again? We promise. I'll watch these two. You go after Honda. That donk, that person you called a donkey is my friend. Now where are you? That's that then. Uh, I see. You want to play a game of hide and seek, huh? Wow, that is a big area. I'm going this way. Hey, nice hiding spot you got there, buddy. Very original. Oh, shit. Cornered. Yes, you cornered yourself. It's all right, Hunter. I'm not going to hurt you. I just want to ask you some questions. <sighs> Fine. Not like I've got a choice. I'm looking for the people who are making you steal for them. Who are they? Call themselves the Car Stones. They said they'd give me good gill if I did what they taught me. I knew they were bad, but it doesn't come for free didn't come at all half the time before I started buzzing for them. I mean, if I didn't do it, they'd just pick on someone else. Someone they could push around easier. Hansa. You found him then? Jill. Where are the other two? Eloise is watching over them. She sent Goots and I to look for you. <laughs> You're... him! I haven't got your pass anymore, if that's what you're after. I gave it to the car stones. Whatever you do to me, I can't get it back. Not that I go against them, anyway. If it weren't for their gill, me and my mates would have starved. We're not gonna beat you up or anything. Cowards. You will not force another child to do your bidding. What the heck are We're you- not what are you talking about, bro? Don't hurt him. Oh, bro thinks he's Zack from mistake. Final Fantasy Seven. We're on the same side. Like hell we are. <sighs> okay. Am I gonna need to teach you a lesson? That brooch. Where did you get it? <laughs> Must it feel? <laughs> <laughs> Goots, what are you doing with these people? I Go. guess you're the ones my sister was talking about. Oh, so you just jumped in my without sister. even thinking? Cool. Good. Good job. Actually, how did you not even see Goots to begin with? Eloise didn't tell us she had a brother. And why would she? I'm just a back and a blade. 
Theodore, at your service. Sorry about before. Theodore, what do you know of the cast stones? Vultures who have made Botlad their hunting ground. They prey on the desperate, stealing from those with Gil and bullying those without it into joining their flock. I'd been looking into their activities in hope of sparing the refugees any further hardship. But it seems they've already stooped even lower than I'd feared. Hans is a good lad. Don't blame him for what they've made him do. If he and his friends hadn't I mean, I don't. work for the stones, some other poor souls would have. On pain of death, most likely. Clive, was it? And my sisters asked you to help put an end to the pickpocketing. Then we all want the same thing. Let's complete. Cool. So, what's the plan? What else? We find the cast stones and we crush them. Oh, I like that plan. You get your traders passed back, and I make Boglad a safe place again. All right then. All right then. Honza, where are they camped? Don't worry. They'll never know you told us. Couldn't if I wanted to. They always come to town to collect the passes. Meet us outside the gate. I tried following them once, but they spotted me halfway down the trail. Said they'd string me up. We'll try it this time. Which way were they going? Back down the road towards Leighton's Cleft. To Leighton's Cleft, then? Leighton's Cleft is to the south, past the camp. Okay. Oh, jeez, that's far. Hansa snitch for real? Bro, it's a kid! What do you mean? <laughs> this, kid, this, is, this isn't some gang stuff, what do you mean? <laughs> the kid didn't have a choice if he wanted this to live! No time to ride. That's a whole different, like... That's a whole different ballgame. <laughs> okay, on. dude. Go on, 4D. Yes! Wait a minute, what the? What do you mean? Oh, I didn't think it would be that simple. Hey guys! Oh no, a sword! That's Whatever shall I do? Walks up, business. uses flames of rebirth. <laughs> oh, I should have? Oh, really? Anyway. I think you should have uh, noticed that I'm him. But anyways, go get him, Jill. You got this. Nice. I doubt these are the ringleaders, but at least we know we're on the right track. I was really sure I should have minded my own business. <laughs> yeah. Hey, look, there's more. You guys are lucky I don't have flames of rebirth this time. Oh, they got a magician. We got Should've did more than just stand there, buddy. I was waiting for you. You didn't make a move. Honestly, it was probably better that you got stabbed by Jill because I was about to just like beat the absolute 
ever looting. Oh my god. You're just lucky, man. You're just lucky. I think we found the lair, lady and gentlemen. Ha. Not a bad haul today, eh? Aye. Some of our new recruits are natural born ne'er do wells. Especially the little ones. That Hans has got nimble fingers, all right. <laughs> it will be a shame when they chop them off. But till then, let's make the most of it. You guys are weird. I'm gonna beat you up now. Scum. Yep. Yeah, they are. The leaders of the cast stones, I take it. They don't deserve any mercy, Clive. I wasn't planning on showing them any. We're ready when you are, Theodore. Oh, I'm ready. Hey guys, what are you doing? From Kill him! Kill them all! You tried it. And it didn't work. What a surprise. <laughs> get on, get on, get on, get on. <laughs> and they say crime doesn't pay. Gold chains, rings, purses. Ah, and traders' passes. Dozens of them. Have the names been changed? Not yet. I recognize some of them. No doubt Goots's is somewhere among them. Now I just need to sort through it all and return everything to the people it was taken from. We should go and give Eloise the good news. Can we leave things here in your hands, Theodore? Of course. Oh, and, uh... Be sure to tell her of the part I played, won't you? We'll be glad to. Alrighty. Bless up that there's a fast travel point there. <laughs> Clive, how goes the hunt? My brother isn't getting in your way, I trust? Quite the opposite. So it was the cast stones who were behind it all. Theo told me he'd been on their trail. And their demise solves three problems at a stroke. That of the pickpockets, the bandits pulling their strings, and the passes they were stealing. I only hope yours is among the items you recovered. Only time and Theo's return will tell. Speaking of whom, welcome home, dear brother. You are too kind, Eloise. Here, Clive. Goods is past. 
Ask him to keep a closer eye on it from now on, would you? I will. Thank you. El, I've asked our boys to carry the rest of the goods back. Can I count on your help in sorting through it all? Of course. I'll make some space in the storeroom. I expect you'll soon be on your way, then. But it wouldn't do to leave without introducing yourself properly, would it now? Sid. Don't look so shocked. We're on the same side. I don't understand. As you now know all too well, we at the Crimson Caravans are always happy to help those in need. For a small fee, we will move anything that needs moving. Be that goods to market, or bearers away from it. I was the first my sister helped escape. If it wasn't for her, I'd have been branded as a boy. I had no idea. It just so happens that we are seeking to expand our operation. And who better to join forces with than the leader in the field? Wouldn't you agree, Theo? I would. It seems our purpose is the same in more ways than one. So what would you say to working together again? It would be our pleasure. And our honor. The honor is ours. Here, Clive. This is for you. Wanna get another badge? Crimson Compass. What is it? El has friends in high places while I have associates in uh, lower ones. That mark is proof that you're a friend to us both. The collar and the compass. I shall bear it with pride. Well, all that remains is to wish you a safe onward journey. I need Boots art of just to like you a place on the caravan. But if you encounter any difficulties, we would be delighted to provide you with a coach of our own for a discounted price, of course. Say nine million? Nine we'll million? Try the caravan. <laughs> nine million? You're crazy, lady. Rest of the thunderstorm. Right then. Let's get this back to Goots. And then it's on to the Dominion. <laughs> Nine million. You are wild, lady. Okay. Nope, not touching this. I'll touch it off stream. Not doing it. Out of my sight, wretch. Come on, come on. Caravan stops Juicy next. Juicy your What I really want to be is a blacksmith. You're gonna do an apprenticeship or something, then? Here you are, good. Try not to lose it again. Me pass? You found it! Oh, thank you so much. Nan would have killed me if I'd come back without it. I'll have to say thanks to Ellen, Theo too. So should you, Hanza. You and your friends don't have to steal anymore. If anyone threatens you again, you know who to turn to. We do. And we already have. Miss Ellen's given us a job shifting the chocobo shit out of the stables. It's hard work, and the pay isn't half what we got from the stones. But if we stick at it, we'll keep ourselves fit. <laughs> you stick at it, then. And Goots, I'm sorry for stealing your pass. Nah, that's all right. I've got it back now. And all's well that ends well, eh? You said you're trained to be a blacksmith, right? Well, I'm going to be your first customer. I'm going to save up all my gear and get you to make me a massive sword. I'll, I'll do me best. <laughs> Till then, eh? Hansa, Ock. What do you mean, Ock, dude? It's a kid, 4D. Oh my gosh, grow up. Alright. We have a place on the wagon.
Remember, Goots. We're mercenaries. You hired us to protect you. But mercenaries. <laughs> and you remember the plan? You're to ride all the way to Twinside. Jill and I will go with you as far as the outskirts, then find our own way in. I'll buy that stuff I need. Right. And we'll scout out the Imperials' defences. There's a square with a big bell tower right in the middle of town. If you get lost, or out goes wrong, we can meet up there. All right. Let's go. Dude, 40, can you tell Soviet to turn his VODs back on, bro? I'm trying to see this man's reactions to all the... FF16 story and he doesn't have his VODs on. I see. And you're quite certain your father has no knowledge of Ultima? I am. I have no difficulty believing a sinister force has come to exert an influence on Sandbrek. But be that as it may, it is yet to claim my father. For better or worse, his radiance speaks his own mind. Oh, so great. He's just stupid. And the fiend works from the shadows. I confess, when first you told me of this fiend, I had my doubts. And more than a few at that. A beast that labors to plunge Valisthea into turmoil, all in pursuit of your brother. But that wound is proof enough that evil is afoot. He's passed me now, so I can't I go back there. Oh, damn. Your Highness, and you will join me in my fight. I cannot. Not yet. Your Highness, please. As you are aware, the Dalmechian army is at our gates. They have lost their mother crystal, and with it all hope of a negotiated withdrawal. It is but a matter of time before they invade. Muhammad is not here to meet them. My people will be slaughtered. Though not by Hugo Kupka, thanks to Ultima's machinations. I know the fate of your people weighs heavy on your conscience, but if we do not put an end to Ultima's plans, they shall face a far darker fate. The chaos he would wreak would sweep all of Valisthea into the abyss. The lives of every man, woman, and child in the Twins are at stake. I believe what you say, Phoenix. But I have duties of my own, and I must discharge them. Come what may. Understandable, to be honest. Whoa. What a transition. What do you know of my blood? I know that it is wholly unworthy of the highest offices of state, which rightly belong to those of purer breeding. She's so weird. Alas. Your bloodline runs through the Oriflam gutter, from a whore who weighed her child's worth in gill. Have you threatened my father? <laughs> of course not. I merely whispered in his ear. That his mongrel son is plotting a rebellion. What? Sylvester listens to the words of his astrologers. And they have ears too. You have been feeding them your lies! Should you remain loyal to Emperor Olivier, his radiance may yet crown your head with laurel. And not with tar. <gasps> Fork-tongued witch! Oh, dude, I know that, dude. I know you want to do it. It's understandable, bro. In consideration of your long years of service to the Empire, I shall forgive this uncharacteristic. Shut rudeness. up! Oh my god. Now hurry and make ready, Your Imperial Highness. 
Oh my gosh. Emperor Olivier expects much of you, Dion. Or should I say, of Bahamut. May your fire reduce his enemies to ash. Till all of Valisthea bows to its rightful ruler. Man, I'm going to enjoy slapping you. Actual scum. The worst character in this game. Forty, shut off! There is another darkness that has taken hold of Sandbrek. And until its grip is released, the flames of war shall spread ever wider, just as Ultima wishes. Forgive me. My family has caused you much grief. You are not her keeper, Phoenix. This is a matter for the Imperial household now, and as a member of that household, it falls to me to resolve it. At such time as that is done, what strength I have shall be yours. Thank you, Your Highness. Mm. Let us take to the skies together and bring a new dawn to Valisthea. I should like nothing more. Why do I feel like that maid is given the look of like anxiousness? Or maybe not, maybe I'm crazy. Terence. My prince. Tell me true. Do you believe what I'm about to do is wrong? I... We Dragoons have but one leader, your highness. And we shall follow him unto the very end. This is my decree. For their crimes against the crown, the traitorous Annabella and her usurping son shall be put to death and the empire restored. I, mean, I don't know about the son. He's just a kid who's probably from, from birth being like brainwashed. But honestly, I don't know. But yeah, no, your decree is kind of kind of based. Annabella gotta die. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with you. I won't be satisfied either way, like any other way. She gotta go. Yeah, he's just spoiled rotten. Hey, don't touch my freaking dog, dude. See what happens. One would never guess that these people stood on the brink of war. Oh, y'all gotta kiss here. Come on. They turn to drink to forget their fears. Anything you want to forget? The harbor is empty. And half the market stores too. The city may seem peaceful on the surface, but it's balanced on a knife edge. Were we to give it a nudge, it might be just the distraction we need to reach the Mother Crystal. I thought you might say that. We should send for Gav. We'll need someone to keep the fires we start from going out. And we can busy ourselves scheming until he gets here. I'll send a Stolas then. Uh oh. You good, bro? What is it, boy? Uh. 
What in the hell? What's happening? What's happening? That's what I'm saying. I don't know. Vogel. Definitely not Bahamut, because Bahamut would be making definitely more of a racket, for sure. And like, you know, Bahamut's just huge, so. Oh, mission start though. Fire in the sky. The Holy, look at. I'm sure Vince is fine. He'll be making for the square. The one with the bell tower. In the middle of town, right? Guard, watchman or sentry is to be slain on sight. But spare the citizenry. His Highness's orders were clear. Those were Imperial Dragoons. What the heck is going on? There's got to be some sort of trees happening right now. Hell is going on? Yeah, I'm just straight up confused. Let's go and see. Right. Why do I feel like we're gonna get there and then we're gonna like we're gonna meet Dion and he's gonna think we're the ones we doing this. it? I just hope he's all right. Oh my gosh, y'all. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, make the first move. Make the first move, dude. Come on. Come on. Should have made a better move. Just heard Dion said we was he was staging a rebellion. Well, I know that. Well, no, wait a minute. But why would he start lighting his own city on fire? Oh. Oh wait, were you talking about the guys who were running? And also, no, I didn't hear if that was the case. Slip past my mind. You know, I get that you guys like to tease me a lot and make fun of me, but I feel like when I ask a question, I genuinely don't know what it is. <laughs> I feel like it should be clear that I genuinely don't know what it is. Like, I'm not asking a question or I'm not saying, what did you say? Because I'm just being funny. I just don't. Sometimes I just straight up don't know. Come here. Questions in the no spoiler stream? Oh my god. You know what? Whatever, bro. Let's try. 
just it just wasn't looking good for you, bro. I'm sorry. Dead dragoons. What is this then? It was in the cutscene we just watched. Alright, well, obviously it slipped my mind then. I don't know, man. Never thought I'd be glad to fall into a sewer. Oh, you know what? These guys kind of going off. Why don't we just let them do their thing? There it is, the bell tower. Right, let's go. I don't know. Get the pretender. Get the, get freaking get Annabella, bro. I'll watch. Wait for me to get there, actually. Oh my gosh, she's so annoying. No one likes her. Like, legitimately, the worst character in the game. Like, no one is worse. Uh, a good Hugo choice. is just stupid. Dang, he was smooth with that. Where in Riga's name did you come from? Uh, fire. Yeah, someone who can hit back that's crazy but you're dead so not crazy anymore unfortunately it's crazy for a second and then you die hey Freaking pole keeps getting in my way. Oh, okay. My turn. I have to try better than that. Oh, okay, well that was kind of better.
Come on. Good dog. Stop in the name of his highness. Okay. I'll let you guys say so. Destiny 2 Midnight Coup on the Cabal Imperial oh, Empire oh, reference? You're so stupid! Oh my gosh. It's too busy beating people up to notice that message. I don't think FF16 copied the critically acclaimed and loved Destiny 2, therefore it's an inferior game. Oh my gosh, you're stupid. Goods. I'm gonna search for you, buddy. Where are you? Gonna get to the... How far are we from the tower? Ah, oh, there it is. Yep, it's me. Yep, kill me. Go ahead. It's kind of screwed because we don't know that they're actually doing kind of a good thing here. What's the ability of the Raging Fist? Increases Raging Fist damage by 10%. Ah, uh, for now, just... What the heck? I don't know. I have new weapons, but they're, like, inferior. So they're no oh. 
open up. Surely there's not a boss or something waiting for us on the other side of this door. Oh, an open field? Surely a boss of some sort way? wouldn't appear. Oh! Yo, get off the tower! Oh, that's an... That's a different type of track. Uh oh. Oh, looks like we're gonna it take must care be of one of the dragoons of hats. White dragon. Whoa, this one's a lot bigger than this. Okay. I got fire, you got dra you got ice, I got fire. Nice camera angle game. <laughs> Woo! Nice try. Gotcha. Thought I was too slow. Think again. Come here! I need to not be towards the wall. Freaking barely see anything. Gotcha this time. Dodge that? Ugh. Honestly, you just break. Me, Blade. 
Oh, my boy's Fenrir now. It's over for you. Dragon Dance. Oh, that's that's new. Oh, wow. Okay. No. Oh, it has a range? Oh my gosh. What the heck is this? Boss is doing trios, bro. Get down! For the finale! Burn! Yeah, I'm kinda him. I don't know if I like that fight. The camera was really weird for that fight. Ah, it was fun, what am I talking about? Dragon. <sighs> All right, let's get out of here. Oh. What now? Is that the Mother Crystal's heart? What the hell is it doing up there? Whoa. man This is what this is how you want to do it
What the heck? Wait, the... It's, it's gone. Wait. Oh, wait. What? The crystal reformed to... To protect the mother crystal? This freaking mother crystal has a defense mechanism? What do we do now then? We destroy the heart. We might come back! As soon as the flames die down, the Imperials and the Dalmex will move in. This may be our only chance. And Bahamut has gone for now. You should get as far away as you can, Goots. What? A Navy use lot in the ledge? I can't do that. If you're staying, then so am I. I. I packed everything up before I made a run for it, so if there's out you need, just ask. But I won't be giving it away for free. Nana'd never forgive us if I did. Thank you, Goot. need out you want us to make you something oh we can forge something here what the Finished. yes sir give me that think... finally a new sword give me that and I think finally we could also get this yeah, that'd do yes, it right sir yes you did good work I hope you like it Anything else I can make for you? You don't want me to make yours out else? You've got everything you need then. Wait, it's all done can I then, literally no. just keep. Oh my gosh, wait a second. I reckon I did a good job. You want us to make you something? Okay, wait, no, I gotta get stuff. I just it's all done something. then, no. Uh, no, I'm not done. Stop wears. talking, goose. <laughs> Uh, how else you Why need? Why did I buy another one of those? Whatever. Uh. Now well we're good. Done, then. Finally, we've got a new sword. Dang, this sword looked clean. Holy crap! All right, let me stop this recording.